Welcome back, everybody, to Thronefall. Took me a hot second to figure out how to beat this this last level. And uh, if I did the title card like I think I'm going to, you'll you'll understand why when when you uh, when we get there. Uh, so um, I think I got a nice setup here. Let's let's get going. So I I love the spear, that ability to heal myself and slow people down is just fantastic. I love it. So I, so for my benefits, um, I'm going to take a big harbor so that there is fishing boats on this level, and it's kind of awesome. I want to build... Hmm. Uh, I don't want to take pumpkin fields, because there's no fields in this map. I do like arcane towers. Hmm. There's something with... I do like this option. So those will be my three perks, so my towers are just going to do a lot more damage and just be more resilient. And then I got the harbor for a little extra income. Yeah, nothing grows up here in the frozen north except sadness. Mostly sadness. Uh, I like the idea of another house. I like the idea of stereo houses. Let's go. So these first two levels, we can probably do it without defenses, without guys, without guys or defenses. And I don't think that's me being cocky. I think that really is just the, uh, the difficulty of these waves is not too bad. As I say that, as I'm about to die. Because the targeting on the spear is kind of weird. Yeah, six gold. Let's go. What do I want to do first? Do I want some dudes? I don't think I want dudes yet. I do think that I want a tower. And the fishing wharf. So it's not going to make us much money right off the bat but it will make us a lot of money very much in the long haul. Now, I find with the, this kind of cool, with, like, giving your towers more health, no, they can take that beating while you just wail on the enemies behind you. It's really, really nice, and I hate using my towers as nothing more than meat shields, but honestly, that's all they're good for. <laughs> no, 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 I'm, I'm definitely being very facetious in that. Oh, God, the crossbows. Yeah, I definitely need dudes for that. Uh, dudes. No, those are... Are these ranged guys? Yeah. And the flame archers? Holy cow. The flame archers are absolutely terrifying. Ah, hell, another house. Why not? We'll get, uh, get crazy here. Flame archer dudes, I basically want you, like, ambushing these guys as soon as they hop on... As soon as they hop on the map. Go get them. So the flame archers, they leave like this trail of burn damage. Which I promise is a lot more impressive. See that? These guys are almost dead. And. Oh, get me up, get me up, get me up. Oh. I cannot have them breaking my wharf. Alright, 45 of those do thingers. I think I want to build this. So this allows us to do, like, researches and stuff, and it's really good. Yeah, more range damage is just going to be vital to us not dying. I promise you, this level is a very slow start. But towards the middle part, I'm going to be screaming my fucking mind off. Yeah, our range guys are especially good when it comes to this. And yeah, look at these dudes. The fire trail is just nuts. If, I don't even have I don't even have to play the game. I can just stand over here and the game is gonna play itself. Uh yeah, now I think we're gonna need backup over here. I have enough to upgrade the castle? I do not. 
you have enough to make another house? I do. And, and I think, I think this will be enough. I think this will be enough to hold this off. I find in this game it is very much a balance of... Uh, if you can get away with spending money on your economy, you spend money on your economy. Oh, the Flame Archer dudes also focus fire, like, siege equipment, which is super good, because that's how I always seem to die is to the siege equipment. And it's not fair. I guess it doesn't matter if it's fair or not. Yeah, 17 gold. Look at that. Oh, uh, what do I want? Special ability. No, I don't like that. I really do like the, the builder's upgrade. Just having my defenses, like, build themselves. Or, I'm sorry, have my economy buildings improve themselves. Ooh, but I can build a new wharf. The wharf is just the best way to make money in, in this game, I, I have found. I want... I've got four gold. I can build two more houses. Again, if you can spend the money on your economy, you spend the money on your economy. Uh, yeah, this house out of the way. That should be fine. And I'm pretty much going to be useless. If you build a wharf over here before this, this day, your wharf is pretty much just guaranteed to get knocked down. You're not going to get any money for it. Yeah, so between between our the two defenses here, our archers, we got nothing to worry about. After we're done with this level, I will build the wharf over here, though. Because, again, the wharf is just a fantastic way of making money. All right. Wharf. Okay, so now multiple directions. Let's build the fire archers again. Single defense tower, because I think that's all I'll really need. I'll build a second one, why not? I'm fell. Let's get let's get crazy. And then it's more housing. Actually I do think, yeah, the ranger. The range dudes could prove troublesome. Yeah, let's just build that. Let's build that second defense here. Yeah, and look at that fire damage. That fire spread is so good. I'm not actually super concerned if anything down here dies because it honestly doesn't really matter. There's no housing, there's no housing economic value of that spot anyway, so it really doesn't matter. Eventually this thing is going to fall in like 30 years. It's dying pretty fast. Okay, now we're going to need some more dudes. Barbarians, super good. They're very, very good units. I am a avid fan of your average barbarian. I am a, I am a casual barbarian enjoyer, I would call myself. And now, for the economy. Income from all boats in this harbor is doubled. I think each boat makes a gold, which is why it's so good. You gentlemen, you will follow me. And you will sit your butts down right here. You gentlemen will follow me. And you're going to sit your butts down right here. 
Our goal is to defend the harbor at all costs. My goal is to prevent these guys from causing me problems, because they will go as they go right for your base. Not even a problem. A defense fell. Oh well, at least it's not an economy building. That's kind of the attitude I find you have to have with this. Defense buildings can fall all day. When your when your economy buildings start falling, that's when you're going to have problems. I would like more. I think I'd like more melee resistance. That seems like a really good upgrade. Build another defense, and I'm just going to invest the rest in my economy. Oh, nope, that's not an economy building. That's economy. Hey, you see, this is my Ponzi scheme. Uh, sure. Not really going to help with the hordes this level, but whatever. It's fine. I didn't upgrade this harbor over here because I didn't know if this harbor would survive. And it actually might have. So maybe I could have upgraded it. And I, th I think I will in the next iteration. Or the next, uh, the next day. It's looking like it's a very good thing I didn't upgrade that harbor. <laughs> oh, stop destroying my economy buildings. Oh. See, that's when we would have had a problem. Good, good. I will build a just a few defense structures over here because I can. And you also get a gold mine over here. I don't think there's another gold level gold mine on this level, so doesn't really help you all that much, but it's still gold. I feel so ahead right now. Alright, I think I will save up that. Uh, another defensive structure. And now I think we're okay to start just, like, making more dudes. Yeah, let's start adding more dudes to the roster. Look at all these dudes. I upgraded this, right? Yeah, I upgraded that. Alright, let's gather up all the dudes. We've got... <clears throat> we got murderizing to do. Ooh, there is actually some pretty gnarly guys in this in this next uh, in this next wave. This could be this could be fun. Do whatever burn damage you can. I may have invested too much in... Not enough into my defenses now that I think about it. Yep, Houston, I may have a problem. Actually, I got quite a few defenses over here, so I might be okay. That's right, hit me. Yeah, I don't think we'll have a problem. Nope, catastrophe avoided. I am the best. He says not totally sure if catastrophe was actually avoided. Oh, 
look at all that gold. It's so good. Okay. Castle next level. I need more economy buildings. I like the magic armor that reflects damage. Actually, I don't think this gets me more economy buildings. I think this just gets me a lot more defenses. Like this little cute little fortification here. Honestly, I think I've maxed out my economy buildings. Actually, no, there's a couple houses I think I'm going to build here. Good. That looks good. More dudes, more better. Perfect. All you dudes, you're down here. Ooh, I got two more knights here, so I really got to start upgrading defenses. Archers, yep. Get over here. Defend the harbor. I need it. Oh, yeah. Look at all these dudes. And the mosh pit is cleared out by security. Oh, the humanity. All right, now we got to do some real serious investing on just everything here. I want... These three defenses over here are very critical to just surviving in the future. I'm going to go hot oil on that tower, tower, and we'll see the next level why I'm going hot oil on that tower. I think this one is safe to go ballista. I think. If not, I'll be paying for that later. All right. Unleash hell. If I'd say everything's looking just fine. Looks like we got no problems up there. Could be problems here, though. That definitely looks like problems down Oh, I wasn't paying attention. Good job, me. Actually, it looks like we're doing just fine anyways. So I'm not super concerned. Yep, I'm not concerned. Get these defenses kind of taken ish care of. Again, I'm not super concerned about these. These are, this is fine. This is just fine. A couple of dudes over there. Now that, right there, is a problem. So I recommend making a couple of uh, hot oil upgrades over here. And you'll see why in a couple minutes. More defenses. Upgrade our defenses. I think that one is going to be fine just the way it is. I will build this up as a good wall, just in case. This is going to be one of them hot oil towers. Let's work on this area here. I think having this as a reasonably fortified wall with some reasonably fortified towers will uh, benefit us very greatly. Now let's see if I actually did this correctly. Let's 
So the reason why I said those hot oil towers are so important is because this dude spawns lots of little dudes. And those hot oil towers will actually... Oh, I better... My guys can finish up what's over here. Yep, this is fine. Yeah, the hot oil towers will actually kill all these smaller dudes, no problem. Need to retreat here for just a little bit. Yep, this is all fine. If our defenses there are gonna do just great. Yeah, you can see my ballista towers just every once in a while knocking a good chunk of health off this dude. Dude has so many lives, he's so hard to fight. Oh yeah, that's kind of on our defenses a bit. Yep, no problem, that has all stood. Oh, nope, this is gonna go for our, those dudes are gonna go for our city. We can't have that. Now this is where, this is where I often run into problems. So these dudes will go for our, our base camp and you can't have that. If it takes a little damage, you're fine. If it takes a lot of damage, like, like that, it's down to a quarter. I wouldn't even worry about it. Yeah, that's right. Follow me, follow me. Alright, he's got one more life. Or two more lives? One more life. Two more lives. Yeah, perfect spot for him. The first time I fought this guy, I lost everything. I kept losing all my defensive structures. It was not good. And it looks like this time I will be just fine again. And the Kraken goes down. We came, we saw, we released the Kraken and kicked his ass! Ah, oh, you love to see it. Ooh, I beat my previous high score. Very good. Your archers have much greater range. That's actually a pretty good update. Upgrade. My apologies. Blacksmith upgrades start with one day of progress already complete. So all upgrades finish much faster. Oh, that's actually really good. Kind of limited in its use, but oh well. So, that's how you beat this level. Thank you all very much for watching. I'll see you all in the next episode. <laughs>